Hey guys, it's Jess. Welcome back to the second half, or I guess the second quarter, of my planner flip through of 2016. Today I'm going to be showing you these spreads from April to June and I kind of like did a sneaky peek flip through and boy did my spreads get really good. Like I was like, I love this one. I love that one. I love this one. It's amazing. If you haven't seen January through March and would like to, I will leave the link to that video down below so you can go ahead and watch that and then come back to this one. But without a further ado, let's continue on. I wish I could show you guys like July through August because that's when it got like super good, but we're gonna have to wait for that. So I'm moving on to the first full week of April. It's a super floral kit from I guess Little Miss Paper. Yeah, it was the spring kit from Little Miss Papery and I loved the floral washi. I just love any floral washi because it seems to blend seamlessly together when I use it as a sidebar and bottom bar. They just like reminded me so much of spring and I don't think I had gotten to use like a super springy kit yet aside from I think the Kate Spade one. Kate Spade, whoa, no, uh, Planner Kate one a couple of weeks back. So I love this week because we have a Taco Tuesday in here. Me and my sister did our first wine and design class together and it kind of got us hooked. We went back twice more and then Andrea came to New York with Kirsten and we went to go see Wicked. We went to eat at the Standard and it was just, it was, it was a really good time. So I really liked this week and I also got my hair cut. Wow, that was a really long time ago. So now we're moving on to this week and this was a, another week using Little Miss Papery full boxes. I absolutely love using her full boxes. I never usually buy like the companion anymore because I do have so many like other functional stickers that I can bring them in. But this was the first week I did a glitter sidebar and I like fell in love. Actually I think I pre-planned one week and did a glitter sidebar for that but technically in like sequential order, this came first. And then I used the uh, gold foil Love You watercolor washi from Michaels. I just love, love blue. And I love how this came out. Like I said in my last video, I don't normally get to do like a solid, like one color for a week. So when I do get a chance to do them, I like get super excited because it looks really nice. I love like the sequins in here. And of course I love, 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 love glitter. I also started working at Airy this week and soon quit afterwards and had like a really like much needed like long awaited girls night with my friend Anissa. So as you can see the countdown, if you will, I mean you're not paying attention to the countdown but like I'm paying attention and we come to the week that I leave for spring break and I gotta tell you I've never like hated one of my spreads but I really dislike this spread. I have. When there's a th big thing going on, I kind of put more effort into making that week look super nice. Like when I go on vacation or if a big event is coming up, like Andre and Nick's wedding, I like work hard to make that week look super nice. And that's what I wanted to do with this, like this week. I was gonna say this kit this week. So I had bought these uh, full box stickers from Planning Faith Official and I love them to pieces. I wish they had a better companion of a week to like support them. <laughs> I'm making it sound like a symphony of like stickers. No, 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 stick, stick. Anyway, so this side I like, and because I was leaving in the middle of the week, like I didn't know, like it's, we were going to a resort, so I didn't have any plans. It would be like sleep, drink, eat, drink, 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 sleep, pass out or something, something stupid like that. But since I had to block off the week, I thought this was perfect. This looked so beautiful because I wanted it to be like an oceany week. But then just like this kind of like fell flat. I didn't like the stickers I was using, like the combination of them. I like whited stuff out. I whited one thing out and it's bothering me. I just, it wasn't a great week like decorative wise. I like these colors, but I don't like the bottom washi. I do love the gold, but for some reason it doesn't fit here. And then this just looks way out of place. And for me to say that during like a mermaid beach week is like saying something. But I guess like on a happier note, I did get to go on spring break finally because this semester was brutal. It was Andrea's birthday and it was my friend Carla's birthday. So I guess it wasn't all bad. Now this week ends on the 24th and the next week I'm flipping to is going to be May because we were gone for a week. And like I said, there was no point in putting like drink, 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 sleep, 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 eat all over like an entire week. So I did tape them shut together like I do for my monthly spreads. If you didn't see my last video, I use this like roll on adhesive to 
tape shut pages that I'm not using and that includes the monthly pages and the weeks that I'm not using or don't need to plan. I'm gonna remove this little note that came in a bunch of flowers that I got super special so this was using the birthday kit from scribble prints co i have been saving it and i was super excited to use it i love how this week came out well i love it because it's my birth week but stuff like this like this was like an important week for me to decorate and it came out beautifully unlike the week before so this week is exciting because it was my birthday and my best friend anthony flew out during the weekend to come and celebrate it with me which i thought was super great because he lives in orlando I mean, we booked the hotel for Disney. I turned 23. It was like, may the 4th be with you. It's a great week. May is an awesome freaking night. <laughs> a night, May is like an awesome month, not a night. It's just, it's an entire month. We can fit all of May into one night. So yeah, I use like little decorative stickers. I put another happy birthday here because that's like the day I celebrated. Didn't have any of my, my Saturday classes. I remember that now. All of them got canceled and I was like, yes. I think except for the morning one. I actually can't remember. I promise I didn't drink that much, that much. So yeah, this was a really fun week and it only gets better from there. So this week was the second full week of May and all the May colors and glitters. Normally, as you can tell, I don't decorate to the monthly colors all that much. I did decorate from like the transition of March into April with like the greens and purples, but most of the time I don't like grab up uh, monthly colors. But when I saw like, I mean, it, May is my birth month, so I kind of felt obliged and mint and pink is like a wonderful, like beautiful combination. So I had to, plus she made it in glitter. So let's say it together, I had to. I love this week, I love the glitter. Um, I don't know if anything like I'm crazy happened here. I went to the Museum of Natural History, saw the Jungle Book. I saw the Jungle Book that long ago, my goodness. I watched Deadpool with Anthony, like just like on our computers and stuff like that. Had tacos, man do I eat a lot of tacos. Oh, also this was the week I used an ombre checklist not for to-dos, but for a Etsy sticker shopping list. And this was the week I placed my first once more with love order. Oh, guys, memories. And then it escalated into a crazed obsession afterwards. Good times, good times. Now let's move on to the next week, which was a mermaid week. I do love like this part of the spread. This part I'm not like crazy about, but when I did just the same like coordinating bottom and sidebar washi, I didn't like it. So I put the blue glitter tape in there and I was just like, eh, I don't like it. But like everything else I love because it's like a mermaid kit and I had to have it. Little Miss Papery, like knocked it out of the park with this one. I love the little accents of glitter in the full boxes. The full box, it's just in the full box. I know in like the coordinating like companions and like the deco and stuff there was like this like little thing of glitter inside all these random things but i didn't get it so i really do love this week just this part needs to go and i also had so many to do's like this was crazy i think it's because like no wait are we in april yeah we're in, no we're in may oh my god i was like are we in march like why am i like having so many to do's yeah so we are in may and i think like around here is when school was starting to come to a close and I was like hoping for like at least a C, at least a C. So now let's move on to this week and this week I can say without a shadow of a doubt that you guys loved this week on Instagram. At this point I had not gotten nearly as many likes on any other picture than when I shared pictures of this week. This kit was from the shop Emma's Corners and I was like super excited to use it because I don't use a lot of pastel colors. So when I saw this like the kind of beachy luau Hawaii, I was like, yes, give it to me. I love it. When I did a plan with me for this, I wasn't sure about like the green glitter headers, but it pulled everything in so nicely and I really genuinely do love this kit. And the funny thing is though, it looks so calm and peaceful with the pastels, but this was the week I had all my finals, all my final projects do. It was just totally insane. Also, like I didn't notice in my last video, a countdown had started and this one's like ending pretty, pretty soon. It was a countdown to Disney World. Like I mentioned in our last one, we booked it and then now it's like slowly getting closer. I loved that the time between booking the flights and putting down the 30 day countdown was such a short amount of time because like I hate waiting for vacations. As soon as I book it, I'm like, yes, let's go. So now we're into June and I love, love, love this week. It was a week right before I left for Disney because we left on a Tuesday the next week and I started my summer class, which is not so fun, 
but like I love these colors. I love this like blue green with the orange and uh, I don't even know how to like form a co like a coherent sentence. I was gonna say cooperative sentence, a coherent sentence about this. I have like to-do lists. They're so cute little everything once more with love stickles. I went to Dumbo with my friends, which if you're not from New York City is basically like a park between the Manhattan Bridge and the Brooklyn Bridge. And Oh, I just love these colors so, so much, and I'm so glad I used it. Again, it was kind of like my transition into June, but I don't even know, because June's like blue and red and whatever. I just love this week so much. So my summer class started on Wednesday, so I had Wednesday, Thursday, and then Monday, and then I literally left on vacation. Like, summer classes are not a joke. If you miss three days, it's, it's basically like missing a week. Actually, yeah, like two weeks of school, which I'm glad it was in the beginning, because if I had missed it in the middle, I would be so fucked. But anyway, I love this spread as well. This is the Buy the Sea kit from Scribble Prince Co. When she released it, I was like salivating. I wanted this kit so bad and it needed the perfect week. We were going to Florida, so it seemed like the perfect time to use a beach kit. I really wanted to use kind of like a Disney-ish kit, but since we were going to like Florida and we were only going to amusement parks two days, I figured it was well justified to use a beach kit. We went to the beach twice, so it all worked out. This was the first week that I actually ended up putting down um, a glitter sidebar. I I love it so much. You have the thinner washi from Scribble Prince Co. This is before the thicker washi came out. Yeah, this is before the thicker washi came out. That one had it. I just used it in a weird order. And I used some gold, gold, gold foil washi on the bottom. Full boxes everywhere. Little road trip stickers, Tsum Tsum stickers, like Mickey Mouse stickers, candy apples. This week was freaking perfect. Like once more with love. Did I already say that? I probably already did. This this week makes me emotional. It's beautiful. If I could, I would frame it, but I kind of like keeping everything in one in one week. <sighs> okay. So now let's move on to the next week before I start like crying and like giving like an award speech. It was also my best friend Anthony's birthday this week. In case I didn't mention that. So now moving on to this week. This week is a lot of fun because I actually didn't plan it. My sister planned it for me and I have the plan with me that she put up with it down below. All of the spreads in this video do have a plan with me so I will link them down below if I remember. If not, let me know in the comments and I definitely will link them down below. And this is the one that my sister did. I think she did a fairly good job fairly good. That doesn't sound like a compliment, does it? But I think she did a really good job considering she'd never like actually planned before. All she had to go on was my um, plan with me's. I did, it was sort of empty, so I did. There's like some of my flair in here, but a majority of the decorating was her. The only thing that like killed me in that video was like her picking up stickers and peeling stickers and also using full boxes where I told her my list needed to go. So this was no bueno, but it's fine. I love this week. I'm so happy she got to do it. And now she's like, she said she was like low-key, like even less than low-key into planning and now she has a planner and she's obsessed with Scribble Prince Co. She's always like, Jessica, her kids, she's gonna make me go bankrupt. And I'm like, doesn't she make us all kind of go bankrupt? And now moving on to this week. Oh, I forgot to put this back in. Hold please. Where is it? Okay, so this week was super exciting. It was the first week of summer and I could not wait to use the Summer Bliss Kit from Little Miss Papery. This was also the week I went to go see like the Queen. I don't know where this is going. Ellie Goulding concert. I love Ellie Goulding. She was like one of the first concerts, like legit concerts I ever went to. I went to see Mariah Carey's like Christmas thing, but I don't count that as like a concert, but everyone else counts it as a concert for me. But I loved her. She was amazing. We got on the wrong line, me and my friend Florine. We ended up getting on the wrong line. And these two girls were like, hey, do you want these general admission tickets? Like, we're not going to use them. We bought them accidentally. I don't get how she, they bought them accidentally. And we were, like, convinced that it was, like, this weird thing. They didn't make us pay for it or anything. They were just like, yeah, we couldn't sell them. So you can take them. And we were, like, so close to Ellie. Can I call her Ellie? That she was like sweating on us and I was living for it. I felt bad when I didn't know the words to the song because then I was just kind of like bopping around to it. 
but I got there eventually. So that's what I have on a coil clip. I have the ticket that they gave us. To be honest, one of the reasons I was like super excited the girls wanted to give us their ticket was because it was printed like as an actual ticket and not just like on a piece of paper because like I always get them printed but I love like actual physical tickets. So then I can put them in here. But let me keep this here. So this week was the summer bliss kit from Little Miss Papery. Like I said, I love like the bright pinks and the, like the pops of yellow and the golds and the flamingos. It is just so cute. And I caught it this time. Another countdown has started. This year is just like amazing for travel. Like, oh, I love to travel and I'm so glad like this year I got to do a lot of it. And that was kind of like a hope, not a resolution, but like a hope of mine that I would get to travel a lot this year. So my countdown to like moving, my countdown to coming over to be a summer intern for Scribble Prince Co. started this week. I think it started the week before. Oh, it did. My bad. Oh, I caught it at least like towards the back of it. So yeah, this was my like first week of a summer kit and I really love how it turned out. I, this was the week I also implemented like a little bit of like Mandy plans in here by using like a piece of washi instead of just like a full box or a quarter box and then a little once more with love sticker there. And I also saw Finding Dory. I loved this movie marquee and I was like telling my sister, I'm like, we need to see Finding Dory because I have this movie marquee and I want to use it. This is the last week I will be sharing with you guys. It is another Little Miss Papery kit. It is the Hello Princess kit that I've had for a very long time. I actually had the full boxes for this kit for a very long time. And then when Little Miss Papery opened up her shop for like kind of a free for all, I decided, you know what? I really want like the coordinating functional stickers and like the washi for it. So I had to wait a very long time for those to come in. And that's why this week got pushed back. If they came in earlier, this like spread would have been done a couple of like pages back. But it's fine. I love, love the colors. I got my panda box in like the week before and then it came with like pink and gold washi, which I thought was perfect. I went to like the beach for the first time this summer, went to the pool. It was my, it was my dad's birthday. Oh yeah, it was my dad's birthday this week. So we celebrated over the weekend and it was Canada Day, like Canada Day. I'm American by the way. And this was the week that I hit 10,000 Instagram followers, which is absolutely insane. So I marked it with a box here and I was waiting for my like glitter tape munchkins to come in so I can mark it like that because like this is where glitter tape started from. So like I had to mark it with a glitter tape munchkin, which by the way, you can now get on once more with Love's um, shop. So go crazy. So yeah, thank you so much for watching guys. If you haven't yet watched the first like quarter of this planner flip through make sure to go check it out and if there's any like plan with me's you want to see i'll have them all listed down below i really want to show you guys like the next spreads that i've done because they get even better than this and i'm not like tooting my own horn but i'm genuinely proud of like the spreads i put out because they make me so happy and like i love being creative with them but you're gonna have to wait until i think october to see july through september well, i guess till the end of september i can't wait to see what you think of these uh, flip throughs i will be back with a haul soon and then after that we should we should fingers crossed have a, another uh, plan with me and i guess i will talk to you later